Hi, I'm Callan Walker, your host for Marketing for Your Future, where we talk with expert marketers from across the country and learn the ways that they are innovating this marketing industry. Our guest today is Jason Yorkmark with Socialistics in Seattle. Welcome, Jason. Thank you for having me. Yeah, we're excited to have you here. So tell us a little bit about Socialistics and your role within the company. Sure. We are a full-service social media agency, and uh, so we do social media end-to-end -end for clients, organic, paid, and influencer. Um, I'm the owner, founder, slash CEO of the agency. Uh, we've been in business for a little over four years, and uh, we're a virtual boutique-sized agency, and we service clients uh, across uh, the country and uh, usually mid-sized, I would say, at this point. So businesses that uh, are B2B, B2C, usually e-commerce, Food and beverage is an area that we spend a lot of time with, but ultimately we help businesses tell their stories on social and do it in a way um, to drive measurable results. Great. Um, I love that you're saying measurable too, because sometimes marketers, we, we get, we hear from clients that they were promised these big ideas or these big results and mm -hmm. the numbers never really match. And I'm sure you've got clients I have too, or I hear that story and I go, we're going to talk numbers. We're going to actually have data that support and drive your actual business forward. So what are some of the ways that you tie your efforts on social media to mm -hmm. actually their bottom line or growing their business? Yeah, for sure. I mean, I feel like that's a big difference for us. Um, vanity metrics are really easy to accomplish, you know, likes and, and follows and shares and things of that nature. But really where the rubber meets the road is when you can kind of marry what you're doing to real results, which for us, and most marketing agencies is customers, leads, and sales. So ultimately, we, we have to show that the work that we're doing is translating to that in some way. I mean, certainly we come across clients that, um, you know, building their brand is their priority. So those vanity metrics do play a part in that. But I would say the majority of our clients are looking to kind of figure out how what we're doing or what their social media efforts are doing in terms of how they translate to the number of leads or customers or sales that they drive. And Ultimately, that's what we report on. We got to make sure that the work that we're doing is contributing to that and that we're being a good partner and advisor uh, in the things that happen on the sales side to make sure those things are aligned so that when we bring those um, folks to the table, that they're ultimately doing the thing that they want them to do, which is fill out a form as a lead or, or buy a thing um, or contact them for, for more information. Yeah. Um, definitely. I think uh, focusing on the actual metrics that drive their business is going to be a value asset to any client that we work with. Um, yeah. How do you feel that the business of social media, or doing business on social media has changed over the last couple, even the last couple of years? Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of different things. Uh, certainly attention spans are shrinking. So, um, you know, the content that we create really uh, needs to tell stories in a very consolidated, concise way. So uh, short form video has gotten very, very popular, uh, obviously with the growth of things like TikTok and, and Reels on Instagram, you know, people are looking to just, you know, power through, you know, five, 10, 15 second videos. So, you know, short form video is a big thing, um, making sure that our messaging is on point, even in static graphics or, or copywriting, really being concise is, is key. Um, so those are big things. And, and one of the things that, you know, might seem counterproductive, but we always tell our clients, it's better to be great at less than average at everything. So a lot of times clients come to us, you know, wanting to be everywhere, but their budgets and resources don't really allow for that. So it's like, well, you know, who is it that you're trying to target? How do you define success? And let's focus in on the channels and the strategies that are actually going to create some momentum with you and work within the constraints of the resources and the budget that you have to work with. And then let's build off of that. So I think being very specific and methodical about where and what you do and telling short form stories in ways that are digestible and, and quickly accessible uh, by your audience uh, certainly are, are trends that we see um, that, are, that are happening right now that are, have been successful for our clients. Yeah, um, I, I say the same thing. My attention span, my own personal attention mm -hmm. span has gotten even smaller and, and I create yeah. the content. So the version that we, yep. you know, that you guys produce is probably even longer than what they actually, what they actually finally see. So, um, sure. you know, I, I appreciate you being on with us today. And all of those tips are great for those that are mm -hmm. looking to, you know, stand out on social and, and really understand the value that they add to their clients and, and what platforms they should be choosing to be on um, instead of being average mm -hmm. at everything. I think that was great advice. Yeah, so thank sure. you so much for taking the time to be with us today. 
Absolutely. Thank you for having me on. Great. So if you want to learn more about socialistics, um, visit dailyadbrief.com. And with that, I am Callan Walker with Daily Ad Brief and Marketing for Your Future. And I will see you next time and have a great rest of your day. Simplify presents addressable CTV, combining the power of TV with the targeting and attribution of digital. Simplify's addressable CTV delivers massive reach with the ability to scale without sacrificing precision. TV buyers can generate incremental reach with household level targeting, frequency controls, reporting, and insights. To learn more about Simplify's addressable CTV and what it can do for your clients, visit simply.fi.